Hey friends, Raj here with you. I'm going to go ahead and suggest you don't do this. And if you do, I take no responsibility if it messes up your stuff. Hasn't messed up my stuff, as far as I know. But uh, I do find it interesting, so maybe you'll find it interesting too. So I'm a UAD user. Uh, if you've been around the channel for any length of time, you may already have known that. Uh, I have a couple of Apollos, satellite, twin, an old PCI card. I just recently got one of the new M1 MacBook Pros. It's not my main machine, but I would love to use it for remote session work and the like. Up until today, it has definitively not worked with UAD, and they have said as much, and they still say as much. This is not supported. They consider the M1s at this point to not be qualified. I found that word interesting, so I downloaded the software V9131, and I installed it, and it installed on the M1. Uh, when I restarted, console was there, control panel was there. Control panel had an error that no drivers were installed, so didn't have much to lose. Reinstalled it, this time with the twin powered on and connected. And the second time, it took, for whatever reason. Here's the M1. Here's the twin that I'm talking about today. So for the rest of this video, I'm gonna switch over to that machine so you can see what's going on. Speaking to you now via my twin through uh, this M1 MacBook Pro. So let me show you what we've got here. Here's control panel, system info. There's my twin, it's just a solo, so not a whole lot of juice on this, but uh, next up will be my Apollo, so we'll see what happens. My eight Ps. So yeah, uh, that's all good. Right now I'm not running any plugins, so if I hop over to console, you can see console is working and doing all the things it's supposed to do. And if I want to throw a Neve on here, then we have a Neve. Loverly. I'll leave that on. Do a little high pass. And uh, how about we drop... LA2 on there and here is LA2 gray and you can see and you can hear that it is in fact giving me some gain reduction so that is lovely uh, let me close these and show you logic logic was being a little funky with a few of the plugins it was just fine with the uh, interface itself it um, didn't have a problem right away seeing it and me selecting it, but a few of the plugins for some reason didn't seem to want to load right away. The plugin manager gave me a little grief. I don't know if that has anything to do with, with uh, the particulars of m one <laughs> But at this point, if I look at my UAD stuff, I basically took all of the plugins that Oh, did I miss one? Thought I saw one that I missed. No, I took all the ones that uh, that didn't get validated, and I I chose use, and I just basically forced it, and it seemed fine. I loaded a several of those up in that session, and um, and all was good. So, just wanted to let you know that's an interesting development. All right, y'all have a good one.